I've never seen it like this before. Uh, we years and years ago, we was lucky if we had one or two out there. But we're all sticking together now. We've got all the drivers. We've got the loaders out here. Um, there's not been one dust cart which is passed, and uh, we all agree what we're entitled to. I think. I think actually, if you turn the camera there, the proof's in the pudding. Uh, yeah, you know it's. Uh it, I, I've, like, like Mick's base, the uh, touched on base, I've never known uh, numbers like this strike. It's unprecedented for this council and this authority. It's never happened before, and I think it's a clear demonstration of uh, how unappreciated and how under, undervalued and underpaid we've been for a very, very vast period of time. And with cost of living going up, yes. um, people yes. are paying rented accommodations, which is about 11, 1200 a, a month for just a three bedroom house around here. Their wages are not that, so how can they live off that? You and know I, what I mean? And I know this sounds terribly cliche, but it is true. Some of these guys here are having to choose sometimes between heating and eating. Which is, which is absolutely ridiculous in the year 2022. We shouldn't be having these conversations. These blokes want to go out and work. We're not about striking all no. the time for money. It's about communicating with everyone out here. Um, we don't feel like we've been treated properly. Uh, they don't speak to us. They, you know, we, we don't talk at all to the managers. They just don't want to know. It's about just get on with it and that's it. And this strike hasn't been done on a whim. It's been done with a lot of thought and a lot of consideration and a lot of things taken into account. You know, they say they got all this extra money for us and come and offer us money, but, um, you know, like I said, they need to come sp speak to us, GMB, and uh, let negotiate between us. And incidentally, I think some of the public are very, very supportive. The amount of public that have actually come down here and donated water, soft drinks, all kinds of uh, goodies... You know, it, it, I, I think I think speaks testament that some of the public understand and sympathise where we're coming from.